Kape has just released volume 29 of the ReZero light novel and this video will be going over the new additional light novel interlude which Tape has added. Now this could only be possible due to Ice from Witch Cult Translations which essentially live blogged what happened. Now I highly recommend all of you follow his Twitter because he pretty much posts all of the new ReZero information. By the way, in my last video, I stated that I would cycle through the new volume 29 illustrations, but I forgot to include four of them, so I'll also put those on screen. The interlude takes place at the same time that Chaos Fling is being engulfed in shadows by Satella. We see the story from the perspective of Rem and Priscilla. For those that haven't read the volume 28 sad story involving Rem and Priscilla, since I didn't cover it on my channel since nothing really happened, essentially Rem is helping Priscilla and she's kind of like a maid and volume 28 of the sad story ends with Rem and Priscilla in the bath and Rem is helping Priscilla wash herself. So this is a continuation of that. The scene starts with Rem washing Priscilla's hair However, in the middle of it, Priscilla randomly stands up, moves towards the window, and then cracks it open. Rem states that she's in the middle of washing Priscilla's body. Priscilla, still naked, then tries to lean out of the window, and Rem tries to get a towel for Priscilla's body. Priscilla, however, doesn't really mind just being there naked. Priscilla now steps out onto the balcony, still naked, Rem gets a bit agitated whilst still holding the towel, stating that even if they're on the topmost floor, it's still possible that she will be seen. However, Priscilla cuts her off by stating the sky. Rem is of course confused by this statement. Rem places a towel on Priscilla's body covering her, and Priscilla states to Rem that their vacation has ended. By the way, she uses the English word for vacation, but she mispronounces the word. Rem looks at the sky and notices a black dot. There's one, then two, and the numbers increase. Priscilla then states that they need to get downstairs and tell everyone to pick up their weapons, as a swarm of winged dragons do not mess around. The scene switches and we get the perspective of Madeline who's looking down at the city of Guaral. As Madeline thinks about Guaral, it's noted that Guaral is her target. The blood inside her body heats up in a fierce fighting aura. Her fighting aura, which is getting stronger, then spreads to the surrounding winged dragons, riling them up for a potential battle. Madeline then states, that she gets it and that she'll do as the old man says and she'll make sure to do her job. The old man she's most likely referring to by the way is the Prime Minister of Valachia. She then turns to her dragons and asks if they're ready, her target being to bring destruction to the city of Guaral. Madeline finally states, tremble in fear, try and flee, you all have nowhere to run, I, the dragon, have come and with that the interlude ends. So this is of course why the volume 29 cover is of Madeline pointing so it seems that she's of course pointing and the city of Guaral as she makes this declaration. So yeah it looks like Priscilla and Rem will be fighting off Madeline and this was the new content which was added and that's the reason why Tape released the chapter yesterday because there was a very short period where the light novel got ahead of the web novel and if you've seen my video about this before that's a big no-no so Tape had to release a chapter to make sure that the web novel was ahead of the light novel.